Opposition leader Sajid Premadasar and the Indian High Commissioner to Sri Lanka, Dr. Gopal Bagle, attended the event to declare open the head office of the Tamil Progressive Alliance. Operations throughout the island will be coordinated at the newly opened head office of the Tamil Progressive Alliance in Dikkoya Hatton. <laughs> I will promise you one thing. We will give housing rights to all of you in the hill country as well as the low country families and small scale estate workers as soon as the Samagi Janabalavegia government is established. We will implement new local councils and provincial councils under a new SJB government. It was the Pohotua government that ruined this country. Hundreds of thousands of people are anticipating for a new government of the Samagi Janabalavegia led alliance to revive this country. We will not sell our souls for riches and positions. I request you to unite to build a new law-abiding democratic country. The General Secretary of the Ceylon Workers' Congress, Jeevan Thundaman, also attended the event. The estates can only be developed if community leaders of the estates propose a plan on how to do that. That's the only way the estates will develop. Its first stage started today. We can't engage in politics with hate in our hearts. Only love can take this country forward. We can only be successful if we work together. The leaders must unite in order for the people to unite. <laughs> Tea exports are at an adequate level. We are earning a good income out of that. But the estate owners are not willing to give the workers their fair share. This must be rectified. The General Secretary of the Ceylon Workers' Congress, Jeevan Thundaman, is here with us. I welcome him here as the leader of the Tamil Progressive Congress. This is a new start. <laughs> Minister Vijaydasa Rajapaksa says a committee must be appointed to make amendments to the election process. I believe he is working under Ranil Vikramasinghe's direction. However, Mahinda Rajapaksa says he is ready to face an election at any time. The members of the government are of different opinions on this matter. The committee is trying to delay the provincial council elections, but we are ready to face an election at any time. They must hold an election as soon as possible. We have carried out discussions to transform estate workers into small estate owners under a new Sajid Premadasa government. We can't implement this program by ourselves. There are two major trade unions in the estates. These two trade unions must unite. We may engage in politics in two different ways, but we must unite to serve the estate community. The Malayagam people have a very strong link with India. The people of this region they have contributed, as Honorable Manoganesan said, to building Sri Lanka. So India has also not forgotten you. India also remembers you always. India continues to look after the people of this region. Since the time I came here in January, India has come forward to support the people of Sri Lanka. The people of India know the difficulty of the people of Sri Lanka. And I want to tell you today, people of India will always support their brothers and sisters in Sri Lanka.